In this short video, I'm going to show you how to set custom page breaks in Google Sheets. So if you're trying to print your spreadsheet and you want to specify where one page ends and another begins, um, setting custom page breaks is a good option because it can help you to ensure that your printed file is formatted nicely. So to do that, um, first you would print like you normally print. So you can hit the print button, you can press Control P on your keyboard or hit uh, file print. So I'm going to select print here. And then in the printer options on the right hand side, I have this set custom page breaks option. So you're going to select that. And then I have this blue line here where I can set um, custom page breaks for both the column and the row. So to do this, all you do is you click and hold and then you drag this to wherever you want the page break to be. So I will just show you this. So I have it um, set there and then I can confirm breaks and you can see it set the page break right there. And so if I wanted to, I could just hit next and then um, select my printer and print. If you want to reset your page breaks, it's uh, the steps are very similar. So you hit print, and then um, there will be this custom page breaks option. You hit edit, and then there's this reset button at the top. So you would select reset, confirm breaks. So that's pretty much it for setting custom page breaks. It's pretty simple to do. Um, try to play around with it until you get familiar with using it. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.